I grew up on that farm here and we never experienced anything like that before. So we are suffering and it's just a question of survival till we hope that the rain will come. It's a severe, severe situation. We never, we never experienced anything like that. Before. Okay, have you lost in some of your livestock? Or uh, you sold? We didn't. No, we sold a lot. We reduced about 80 percent. So I'm suffering to to get my 20 percent alive. Okay. With, of course, a hell of a loss at the end of the financial year. Yes, I think the drought uh, is quite uh, bad this year, and. Uh, but we believe that we are going to get good rain this year. So I think we must just uh, push through and uh, stand firm. Um, because I believe that, that the whole situation will, will turn around. Okay. But um, it's, not, it's not nice to see all the animals that are suffering. And if you, if you haven't got fi financial uh, to buy some food for them, it's, so yeah, it's, it's, not, it's not nice to see. Other farmers have sold close to 80% of their livestock just to, in order to sustain, uh, to lessen the burden, the financial burden on themselves. What have you, how have you managed uh, on your farm to, uh, to work around your livestock? Yes, we, we actually did the same. We reduced a lot of the, of the game um, to, to save some of the grass. The crime situation is getting more and more worse and worse with the drought. And yeah, and now we are running from one meeting to the others, which cost us a lot of time. And it's it's hard. It's hard to get forward. Uh, we're only farming game, and but I think the the farmers that are that are suffering the most is the people that are. Um, farming with, with cattle, but uh, the, the game is, is quite good.